Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Hello there! If you didn't know, Paleo was recently released to the Epic Store for most of the world. And I say most because there's actually a pretty sizable market that the game just isn't available in if you're on Epic. And some players from said market are not too happy. In order to understand why Paleo isn't available in some countries, well, we need to understand some laws and some things surrounding them. And so far, I have found three countries that Paleo isn't in. And despite the dad joke cinema joke, none of my countries are going to be Antarctica. Wonder how he's doing. Hello. So to start off with, the easy countries to explain are going to be, well, North Korea and Iran. If you didn't know, the UN Security Council, the US, and a bunch of countries have sanctions against North Korea that prevent companies from doing business there. So Epic, an American company, cannot do business in North Korea. And the same holds true with Iran. US has had sanctions against the country since 1979. So that's, that's why Iran and North Korea are, well, we're not able to play the game if you're from those countries, at least legally. There, There is one more big country though, and um, that country is going to make this video a bit of a part two to my Paleo has an official rating video where I talked about the ESRB quite a bit. And if you don't know what the ESRB is, they are the United States' rating board. And fun fact, they were also the rating board of another country until 2001. That country being Brazil, the final country where uh, this, this game is not legally available on the Epic Store. As a matter of fact, if you go to their Epic Store page, this is what you see. So why is this the case? Well, for the US version, you'll see that there is an ESRB rating here. If we go to the UK version, there is a PEGI rating. And if we go to the German version, there is a USK rating that I will not try to pronounce anything else of. Now, I mentioned that back in 2001, the ESRB was used in Brazil. Around that time, it actually switched to another board that we call Classend, which is an advisory rating system, which is actually somewhat mandatory in order to get your game to be playable in Brazil. And, and I looked through all the records of the said Brazilian rating system. They have no record of the game Palea being submitted for classification. Because it is therefore illegal to sell the game in Brazil, if you're a Brazilian player, you just can't download the game off of Epic if you're in Brazil. That's, that's basically it. I know this is a really boring video. I'm, I'm sorry for everybody who wanted to download the game in Brazil. And there's a lot of people mad that the game didn't come out on Steam or that the game's not out on Switch yet. Uh, trust me, if the game was on Switch or on Steam, it would also not be available in Brazil. So I'm, I'm sorry to all those people. Uh, this is just sort of a, a notation, a little bit of a warning or an explanation for people and uh been trying to keep track of foreign countries availability of this game but hey they they added regions in we're back on north america i have a video talking about this patch coming out for everybody tomorrow morning but i wanted to get this short explanation out as soon as possible i don't know if the game will be rated in brazil but uh it probably will be eventually uh, here are the people that make these videos possible. There, there's my Twitter. I, I sometimes tweet random stuff and uh, have have a nice day. And uh, here's some other video. Bye.